Hey, what's going on internet? Josh Noel from Sunduck Film. In this video, we're going to talk about the technique behind shooting silhouettes. Silhouettes are perhaps my favorite types of shots to shoot, not just because they are visually pleasing, but because you have the opportunity to express what your character is feeling or to help develop your story in a powerful way, and that's the power of silhouettes. In order to correctly shoot a silhouette, you must make sure that your background is brighter than your subject or object. So placing your subject in front of a window, for example, it's a great opportunity to uh, expose right for the background and by exposing for the exterior elements outside the window, we're able to crush all the blacks inside of the building and we have this very nice silhouette that is nice and dark. Of course, the brighter the light source, the easier it is to create a beautiful set of contrast between the background and your subject. You can see here we're able to expose for what would have been the blown out sky because the sun is right behind our subject. And by placing your subject in front of the sun, you're able to either create some very defined edges or some very nice flary scenes. So now we've talked about natural light silhouettes, let's take a look at using your actual set lights to create an interior silhouette. Right here we were able to create an interior silhouette by shining our light towards the wall and making sure that there's no light hitting the front of our subject and we're able to adjust that exposure to expose for the wall making our subject completely crushed. And in the shot we're able to create a very unique edge light by keeping the light directly behind our subject and by exposing for her hair and shoulders, and this gives us a very nice, powerful, unique silhouette. And this shot, for example, if you don't have a bright source of light behind your subject, and you try to stop down on your lens to try to expose for the background, your subject and background are gonna blend completely together, and you're not gonna be able to see anything in the shot. So make sure that the background is brighter than your subject. So that brings us to the end of our silhouette video and I hope you were able to take away a few techniques from this video to apply to your future projects. But if you did enjoy the video, please be sure to drop a like, subscribe to the channel for more videos just like this, and please be sure to hit me up on my social media networks. Those links are in the description of the video. And as always, hope you have a good day and always be creating.